After formally divorcing Ben Affleck over a week ago, Jennifer Lopez is moving forward. The 55-year-old hitmaker of Love Don't Cost a Thing is reportedly feeling relieved following her formal divorce with the 52-year-old Batman star on the occasion of their Georgia wedding's second anniversary. According to a source, the singer is doing as well as she can despite having didn't want a divorce from the actor. The actor was recently connected to Kathleen Kick Kennedy, 36, the daughter of Robert F. Kennedy Jr. According to The Insider, Ben's decision to leave her behind and walk away from their marriage has been extremely difficult for her. She had no desire for a divorce. She was determined to solve the puzzle. They are in love with one another. Jennifer is not the kind to give up easily. She's found waiting around to be nearly agonizing. The divorcing couple had already agreed to these terms before she filed, a source claimed. The two described it as a planned event rather than a filing meant to catch Ben off guard, saying they had gone through all the details of the file beforehand. The source continued, J. Lo was the one who ultimately made the decision, and she was the one who finally pulled the trigger because that was their agreement that she would file. The pair had previously broken up behind closed doors, but chose to pretend to be a happy couple for months by going on sporadic public dates. This decision was mainly supported by the reporting. According to the source, the only substantial common property that needs to be sold is their enormous Beverly Hills estate because both parties came in with significant assets of their own and don't intend to battle over their fortune. As a result, Jennifer sought the court to refuse Ben's plea for spousal support from her former spouse. April 26th was the day on which she listed their separation. On July 16th, 2022, Jennifer and Ben were wed in a small ceremony. Two years later, on August 20th, 2022, at Ben's plantation in South Carolina, they remarried in front of family and friends. This second marriage took place exactly two years before Jennifer filed for divorce. After becoming engaged at the end of 2002, they broke up a year later and ended their relationship permanently in 2004. In the meantime, it has been stated that Ben has recently been seen hanging out with Kick, the daughter of RFK Jr. Before he restarted his relationship with his now estranged wife Lopez, Ben had a brief affair with Kick, according to reports. Kick and Ben are enjoying spending time together, according to insiders, but the writer is keeping tight-lipped about their relationship out of concern that she would be perceived as a mistress. The insider said, Ben and Kick had a fling before he got back together with J. Lo. Because Ben is from Boston and the Kennedy family is royalty when you live in Boston, they met. So when he started hanging out with Kick, he legit thought that he had landed into the Kennedy family. The person stated. However, she wasn't ready for anything serious and was too young. The source emphasized that there was never any crossover between the actor's renewed contact with Jennifer and the couple's romance. They didn't have an affair while he was married. But Kick's friends find it strange that Ben started hanging out with an old hookup whose family he views as royalty as soon as this divorce happened. According to the insider, Kick feels the actor is smart and very much in line with her taste. But she is extremely private since she doesn't want to be mistaken for a mistress. She doesn't have a mistress. She loves to keep her personal life secret and is nothing like J. Lo. The source continued, saying, Kick is fond of Ben, and she does not care what J. Lo thinks honestly, indicating that Kick isn't wasting any time thinking about how Jennifer could feel about Ben's desire to reunite. He was separated from J. Lo when they started hanging around. He was extremely explicit about this with her. J. Lo's April breakup listing merely served to validate this. She is enjoying spending time with him so far, but they are both taking it day by day, the person said, because the Beverly Hills Hotel gives celebrities a level of solitude that no other place does. That's why they hang out there. She finds it flattering that people think she looks like Jen Garner because she believes Jen is gorgeous. Ben and Kick are only getting to know one another better, according to a second insider, who added, Ben has been spending time with Kick, but there is nothing there yet. It's true that she doesn't really worry about what J. Lo might think of her hanging out with Ben. They are friends and like hanging together. They are getting to know one another. And he's a fantastic man.